Hey guys, a very big sad welcome back. Over the past few days, um, my beautiful plate coral has uh, really taken a turn for the worst. Um, I've had this for quite a long time. I'll actually have to go back on my videos to try to see when, but I'm guessing probably almost two years now I've had this and I've grown it up from a really small one and as you can see it is just infected or whatever is going on well I'll tell you what happened it was in my main display it was fused onto the rocks it's been growing really nicely and then uh, way over here this little piece of red plate coral right there had uh, I had glued it onto the rock right above it and a few times it had fallen off or been picked off by my big blue tang and fallen onto this now I, I, you know, I had glued it back on and so it hadn't sat there very long and then uh, the one day it fell off and it was sitting upside down on it and I didn't think much of it just because they're both plate corals so I wasn't overly concerned however I let it sit and then uh, it was about a day, day and a half later whatever when I took another look that I saw a big white patch uh, right in the middle where the um, where the red uh, plate coral was sitting and so I was like oh geez I better get that out of there but uh, which which I did I took it off and the um, and I, th I thought that would be the end of it that it would grow back because I, I've had that like this little piece there that's from an anemone stinging it not a big deal it's growing back over it um, so I wasn't too concerned however Oh, as another couple of days passed, you can see where it's at. It's just, it's spread and spread and spread. And I used a toothbrush today, thinking that maybe that would stop the spread of death. I don't even know what to call it, but right in here, I'll see if I can zoom in and you'll see the progression. If, uh, if that shows well enough in the video, that stuff that's blowing around there seems to be the infection. Um, if that's what you'd call it, I don't know. Now, today came, the, you know, I had to think about it. I've put it in my in my frag tank, first of all, just to um, try to figure out what I was going to do with it. And all I can come up with, and it's a shame to do it, is I'm going to have to start snapping it. I'm going to have to start breaking pieces off. I uh, I love this piece, and, you know, quite frankly, it's the size of it that's probably you know a hundred hundred and fifty dollar plate coral um, store pricing it's I've fragged off it you know several times like there's a piece of it actually just sitting right there on my frag rack and it really sucks but I wanted to share this with you guys because I thought you know what some positives got to come out of this and that positive let it be that uh, a lesson for others that if that happens, don't just think all plate corals are created equally, because clearly they're not. Um, you know, it's definitely not a disease that it caught in a tank or anything, because it started dying right where the red plate coral was sitting. Um, so that's a shame. I just wanted to share that with you guys. I'm going to go ahead now and frag it apart, and then maybe I'll uh, come right back and show you the pieces. Okay, so now the dirty deed's been done and I've broken some pieces off. Uh, you can see that it's, uh, it's crying as the flesh is coming off and stuff, but um, hopefully that'll save at least some of it. Another piece up there which is going to blow around and a couple more little pieces over there that are blowing around. I'll try to stick them to a corner and let them heal and I can always throw them on a frag plug later or something if I want. Um, that's a very bad red coral. Or, I don't know, it's kind of like a reddish pink or whatever. But Anyhow guys, um, hopefully you can learn from my mistakes on that. Um, yeah, what a, what a shame. And I'm guessing maybe in two years that piece will grow back out. And uh, hopefully be the same size again. Thanks for watching, guys. And if you haven't already, be sure to subscribe.